Hey guys, it's me, Kat. Sam's here too, and we're here to do another tag. Yay! This is also a collaboration with two of my really good friends here on YouTube. The first one is Kayla's Way, and the second one is Hot Mess Nest MUA. So Kayla and I started YouTube around the same time. We met through the beauty community, and we've been doing collabs, and she does a lot of tutorials. She is very inspiring because she always pushes herself to do more and more with her looks, which I totally appreciate. And then Vanessa, I met her probably a few months after I started. I was invited to join a Facebook group where we support and do collabs, and she's just wonderful. If you are interested in um, single eyeshadows and indie brands, you need to subscribe to her because that is exactly what she's all about. She gets all of them, and when I say all of them, she has all of them, so she can do a swatch party, she can do a review, she can do a look on all of these indie brands. So, <coughs> so we decided to do like a New Year's resolution tag. I think we're gonna call it the YouTube and Beauty resolution tag. So we'll figure it out. Anyways, there's 10 questions, and I'm gonna tag some people at the end so, oh, not at the end, I'll put them in the description. So check it out to see if you're tagged. But if I don't tag you, and if you wanna do it, please let me know and I will look out for your video. So let's go ahead and get started. You ready, Sam? He's ready. Number one, what trend did you do in 2017 that you won't do in 2018? I am not going to bake. Um, I started watching YouTube last year when I started my channel and I heard everyone talking about baking. I'm like, what's that? And it's where you do like the heavy setting powder under your eye with the concealer, um, after you put concealer to set it. And I tried it and I just felt like it made me look old. I think there's a certain age or when your skin gets a certain texture that it just, it's not good. So I'm not doing that anymore. Of course, I'm gonna set my uh, concealer and I might dust a little bit more excess um, powder if I know that I'm gonna have fallout on my eyeshadow, but I'm not truly gonna bake. I just, it doesn't agree with me. Number two, what trend do you want to try in 2018? Well, there's a couple. One, I wanna to try to contour. I kind of tried to contour a little bit, but I haven't really did it, did it. I actually have a contour palette. I haven't even touched it. And I wanna do that, and I wanna to try to figure out a good cut crease, and I need a good cut crease tutorial for hooded eyes so if you know anyone that has done that let me know in the comments and I will check it out so those are the two things contour and cut crease what's wrong Sam he's got an itch uh, number three what makeup brands are you breaking up with in 2018 um, well I've already kind broken up with them last year but I don't want to talk about it mostly because I don't want to bring up controversy there are certain uh, brands or um, influencers that have done certain things that I found inappropriate so I just uh, stopped using their product I might have given their product away or whatever and instead of just hashing out like bringing up old news i'm just gonna say like you'll just notice i don't talk about certain brands or influencers on my channel number four what makeup brand do you want to try in 2018 i made a video on this but i definitely want to and i'll just reiterate what i said and i'll link it in the description below if you want to check it out oh riff What brands do we want to check out in 2018? Well, we want to check out more indie brands and female founded brands. So I already tried Beauty Bakery and Juvia's Place. I want to try Davina Cosmetics and Melt and Pixie. What else? Women founded brands, right? Right, Rip? Look at her pink nails. Isn't that cute? Number five, YouTube and makeup resolution goals. For YouTube, I want to get better at editing. I just got a new computer, um, so the software on, because I uh, upload, or I film and edit on my iPad right now, but I just got my iPad and now I need to figure out how to use 
the editing, like the true editing software on that. So I want to get better at that and I just want to be a little bit more proficient. It seems like um, I just get so caught up in just doing other things that I'm not like focusing on just like a set schedule with filming, editing, um, and things like that. Like filming is super easy for me, but then I'm always like, oh, it's like almost time for bed. Let me see if I can edit really quick so I have something for tomorrow, which is probably not the best thing to do. And as far as makeup resolutions, I want to have, I want to like be more mindful with my spending on makeup. I'm definitely going to declutter. Um, I'm definitely seeing that I have a lot of multiple stuff and I'm definitely seeing that I might have once loved something and I'm not reaching for it. So why am I keeping it? So I want to declutter and I want to be mindful of my spending. Number six. Beauty guru, big or small, that you would want to collab with and what would you film? Now this one was really hard. I thought about this for a while and uh, there's, two, there's two channels I would love to collab with. One is the Beauty News uh, with Haley and Kat, those Australian girls, oh my God, they're hilarious. And I don't know, and I haven't decided like if I wanna like destroy makeup with them or do a wine time with them because they just like drink and talk about stuff and that's just something up my alley. <laughs> and the next person I would love to collab with is Makeup Struggles. Now she has like all the eyeshadow palettes in the world, or at least it seems like it. Um, I would like to, you know, hang out with her. See ya. He knows that she's in New York and he doesn't want me to leave. That's why. Anyways, I'd love to hang out with her, play with her makeup, just like do a swatch party with her. I know she likes to drink some wine with when she does some of her filming, so I would like to, you know, drink some whiskey with her and just like play with her makeup. That's the collabs that I want to do. Just hang out and have some fun. Number seven, PR list that you want to be on. Oh man. Um, PR list. I guess right now uh, I would have to say like Fenty Beauty mostly because they had they started off with a huge color range of um, foundations which is very exciting I did I wasn't particularly uh, excited about the eyeshadow and I didn't really like the highlighters but that's just me but I'm I'm curious to see where the direction of this company goes and I, and I love that there are several different colors, so my, my tone and my color would definitely be in there because that seems like the most important thing. Okay, if you had a gift card to buy one thing for your channel, would you buy a new camera, lighting, or editing software? So I think since I film my iPad, I should probably uh, get a camera, so. <laughs> Uh, number nine, name a video idea or ideas that you want to film this year. Um, I definitely want to film more collabs, but um, I think just how I enjoy makeup, I don't think I, I want to do tutorials, so I don't, you'll probably see less of that because I don't, you know, I don't know if anyone wants to like learn how I do stuff. But I definitely like to want to do more collabs and tag videos because I think those are really fun. And I think challenge videos are a lot of fun too. And oh, I know. I would love, love, love for my husband to do something with me in my video. Like my voiceover, like my husband does my voiceover or my husband does my makeup or something like that. I would just, I would die for my husband to be on my channel, but he is not interested. So let's, let's. Let's see if he will. Let me ask him again this year. Number 10, and this is the last one. What lessons you learn from 17 that we'll use in 18? So what I learned from um, 2017 that I'm bringing into 2018 is um, don't compare yourselves to others. You know, it's, it's, uh, if you're in this, if you're a content creator, 
and you start your channel and you notice like certain people started the channel with you and they start growing faster than you or vice versa or just don't compare yourself to others wherever you are in this space of YouTube that's where you are and it's perfect and it's fine and um, when I stopped looking at like oh she's already at here how'd she do that or she's already at there how'd she do that it started getting more fun when I just like these are my subscribers this is my channel this is this is what I'm doing this this is how I'm having fun this is my creative outlet and um, yeah so don't compare and totally bring that into this year anyways that's the tag I hope you enjoyed listening to my answers and I encourage you to check out my friends channel both Kayla's way and hot mess nest MUA I do adore them greatly let them know that I sent you and if you are visiting from their channel hello welcome I hope you stick around a while and uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video or you like seeing Sam because you like seeing you guys and uh, let me know in the comments uh, what are some of your makeup resolutions and goals for this year so until next time me and Sam say we love you and take care